Hello YouTube, Farmer Son Prepping here. Wanted to uh, do a video response to We Are The Resistance's water filter video. He did a great job on that video. Uh, and, and the only reason why I'm adding to it is because I feel like there's a thing or two I can add to the conversation. If I didn't feel like I could bring any more information, then I wouldn't do a video. So Joey, you did an awesome job and you inspired me to, to make this video. Because it's, it's so important, and as close as we are to war, war, whatever now, we need to really be thinking about it. Have these preps in order, absolutely. So, he had the uh, Grail Ultra Press, I believe. I have the Grail Geo Press, and, uh, which is a good water filter. And I have, make sure I got them where y'all can see, I have two replacement filters. For the Grail Geo Press, so it's important to have replacement filters. Uh, these are great filters; they filter out viruses and all that kind of stuff. But uh, I believe, according to what I've read, they only do like 65 gallons of water, and after that, you'll need to change the filter. Hence, have an extra filter for it. Uh, also, another thing I wanted to cover that I don't think he touched on, uh, like. And this, this could be like either you're coming home from a trip or if you're still out in the field, you're bedding down for the night. Uh, it's good to take your water filters. Where's my little... Where is that? I did something with it. Here it is. It's good to take your sawyers and blow all the water out of them. And uh, like at the end of the day, you're fixing to lay down and you're not going to use the filter till in the morning or whatever blow all the water out of your filter uh, I've showed this on a video before uh, this water filter I have used many times still works great yes I do have the back wash syringe and all for it uh, and but uh, at the end of the day when you're done filtering water take the little cap off and just blow through it as hard as you can and you wouldn't believe how much water would come out of that the insides of this thing needs to be dry at the end of the day. Uh, if you don't do that, you'll have a bunch of green stuff growing in there over a couple of days. You know, it wouldn't take long to stock it up. So I wanted to bring that to you. Also, uh, Grail recommends after you're done using the filter for the day, uh, they, they recommend three dry runs, three dry presses to get all the water out of the filter on the Grail. Uh, Oh, there we go. So, this is still the original filter. You'll notice the uh, grail, the original filters that they come with are orange. The replacement filters are black. So, uh, they color coded it for some reason. But, uh, grail recommends three dry runs to get all of your uh, liquid out of the filter and let it dry appropriately without the stuff, you know, sitting in there and turning green or whatever. So, uh, of course, you'll have to have the cap off to do any kind of press on this, or it will not work. All right. Set that over there. Uh, I also have a, uh, this has never been taken out of the box, but I also have a Sawyer Squeeze. This comes with a big, I believe, a big bag, gravity width, gravity fed filter, just like the one Joey had. Uh, this is just an extra filter. Never taking this out of the bag. Uh, so I've got my Sawyer Mini, I've got the bag for that, and the straw, and the syringe. And, uh, you know, make sure you got water bottles uh, and, and, you know, metal cups. This is for boiling water. Uh, you know, you need a metal cup. You can see this one's been used. Uh, I spray painted the shoulder of this bottle because it was shining too much in the sun. This is one of those Dave Canterbury... Uh, whatever bottle and cup sets so uh, good to have make sure you got a metal cup you can boil water in and a metal bottle and uh, I keep tinfoil around mine because I don't know you never know when you're gonna you never know when you're gonna need some aluminum foil so it just fits around that cup so good that's where I keep mine at uh, now jean bottles in the summertime uh, if I'm toting water if I'm taking water from the house I'll use the now jean bottles 
Uh, I did just recently get this 48 ounce. But uh, these, and for the uh, purification pills, the 32 ounce bottle is best because it, it's, uh, it's, you got the markings. The Nalgene has the markings for 32 ounces, which is one liter, which is what you're supposed to have when you do the purification pills, like uh, Joy was saying. And uh, so I just wanted to make sure, yeah, you know, make sure you got your water preps. I also have a travel Berkey in there. Most of you have seen it in other videos. I'm not going to drag it in here. But, uh, you know, make sure you got ways to have drinking water. It's, it's the most important thing, uh, aside from ammo, if you ask me. Uh, it's the most important thing. Uh, and another conversation I wanted to have if you've uh if you went through all your filters they're all stopped up and the survival situation is still going on and i read this in a military manual somewhere drink the water instead of not drinking the water and absolutely passing away take a chance drink the water maybe you'll get rescued in a week or two and they can uh they can fix that once you get to the hospital or whatever but uh if if you have no way to filter the water drink the water because if you don't drink water you will most assuredly die so i read that in the military manual somewhere or survival book so i wanted to say that as well but uh those are some of the things i wanted to add to the conversation and keep your water bottles full y'all there's water in these and there's water in that one the steel one too uh you know so make sure you make sure your water preps are up to up to snuff i should say and uh i've got another one of these bags somewhere it's a yellow one but uh i've also got a couple of camel bags that i don't really like them and i don't really use them but should i have to i got some of those as well uh so yeah make sure you've got water filters make sure you've got extra water filters if you have a grail if you're going to do the grail make sure you have extra filters for the grails these are not cheap but when your life depends on it, you got to have it. Uh, I'm serious. These are 60 bucks a piece. So, uh, <laughs> but, uh, I've only got two right now. But I uh, also have extra filters for the Berkey as well. And you under in the kitchen. So uh, I wanted to thank Joey. We are the resistance for making his videos. And uh, I just wanted to add that little bit to it. Make sure at the end of the day, you're blowing all the water out of your filters or you're dry running your, your grill here. Uh, to make sure water's not sitting inside the filters and turning green or deteriorating the filter itself, you know. So, uh, thank y'all for watching. This is Farmer Son Prepping. I'm no expert, and, uh, you know, I'm still learning on things just like everybody else is. But uh, I hope this helps. Uh, I hope this helps somebody. Make sure you got your water preps in order. Because we may have to use them tomorrow. Who knows? God bless. FSP, we're out.